Hello, good afternoon, good morning, good evening, my fellow creative designers and content creators. Welcome once again to another exciting episode on this channel. And in today's episode, we are going to design this um, cylindrical text effect in Photoshop. And this is the previous tutorial we created. That is a Photoshop liquid file text effect. And if you haven't checked it out, then kindly go and check it out. And these are them. And they look awesome. Let me just show it to you. And they are here, please. If you haven't watched it out, kindly go and watch it out. And then subscribe to this channel. Add all the images in Pinterest.com and you can check it out and download them. So without wasting your time, just this is what you are going to create. But basically, we are going to use maybe a different image and you should be able to work with that. So control N to open a new document. And I'm going to use film and um film and videos and then this side and then the size is what width is one two a zero height is 720 resolution 72 and then i'll click on create boom so i have this nice background with me quickly i'll go to my resources file and then drop these two images over there i'm going to use them for the tutorials okay so my image has been imported successfully i'll just ctrl t to select the first image and then scale it up nicely like this yes just scale it up nicely like this and this is awesome and i mean in the first the, the beneath one and then this i put them in a group and call it bg yes so all this tend to bg and then i open the bg group and then go to this side and pick a solid color and come and pick this color for this bg very good very good so with this i right click it and then convert rasterize type rather and then go to this w on the keyboard and then select subject yes with the first image selected subject and leave the background separately like that all right so with the subject selected ctrl c to copy it ctrl v to paste it again awesome 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 then if you hide this and the background you realize that we are getting only the image separately yes we are getting only the image separately yeah we are getting only the image and if you bring this you have the image and the background both appearing it okay thank you very much then what you are going to do is to hit on the um type 2 and then hit here boom and then let's type any text at all let's type any text let's type any text so we can type something like welcome back welcome back all right so enter and then let's change the color let's change the color let's change the color to something closer to this and i think this is awesome this is awesome this is awesome ctrl t to select it and then scale it up like this scale it up uh, back like this to your preferred choice yeah you scale it to your preferred choice ctrl t again and then you right click it and then wrap it this way all right so once you wrap it then go to this uh, arc and then go and select cylinder good then you push here a bit upwards like this a bit um it should push it should push it should push okay something nice like this not too up like that and then press enter and then check it that way and i think ctrl j to duplicate it and then ctrl t again and then you wrap it again you wrap it again and then you turn it up like this something like this and this is awesome this is awesome this is awesome this is awesome then go to the uh all right so ctrl t again and then you flip it that way then the text has been flipped very good then the copied one drag it beneath this image awesome 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 that is it that is it that is it that is it then select these two text select these two text and then link them up match them up all right all right then if you are able to move it this way awesome 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 
Now I think with this text, let's unlink them. Let's unlink them. Let's unlink them. Okay. So with this copy text, let's go to this side and then come and pick something. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just come to this side a bit and then you should create some form of a reflecting reflection at the back. Perfect, perfect. Then click on OK. And then you select the two of them to link them this way. Once the text is linked, you can just pick anywhere and be pushing them up like this or down like this. And then you just put or position it at anywhere of your choice, guys. So this is how to create a cylindrical text effect in Photoshop. And then you can just play along with it. You can just edit and um, just hit here and then maybe edit the text and then maybe just write anything um, um, um you can write um good morning and just you can write anything you can write anything you can write anything and you are good to go you are good to go but i prefer welcome back and guys as i said this is how we were able to create this text effect i have these images i'll post them for you to practice and then use it for free yes you realize this is it this is it and then we also have this since the text has been linked together yes we have linked the text together so once you pick any of them and then you move them both of the texts are moving or move at the same time because it has been linked together so please subscribe to this channel like share comment and then let me know any questions you have for me in a comment section or in the suggestion box i love you i will see you in the next tutorials bye for now